everybody welcome to Garrett the Gamer channel my name is Garrett welcome to my channel today we're gonna be doing some more of Starcraft Remastered Cartoon Edition well me yeah that sounds right last time we left off we were getting rescued by good guy Arcturus Minsk and uh, today we get to go to the Jacobs installation can't remember why we have to go here Your tenure as Colonial Magistrate is suspended, pending an official investigation of your affiliation with the Sons of Korhal. Receiving incoming transmission. Hey man, Arcturus's boy sprung me from the prison ship. Apparently they're as frustrated with the Confederates as we are. I know their reputation, but they seem to be on the level. I think Arcturus wanted to speak with you. Commander, Mar Sara is almost completely overrun by the Zerg. The Confederates are abandoning the planet, and so are we. However, there is one thing I'd like to do before we leave. I want you to raid this colony's Confederate outpost and retrieve whatever design or weapon schematics that you can find in their networks. With the chaos of the Confederates' evacuation, you shouldn't have any trouble getting in or out of their installation. I'm into it. I did adjust some audio levels and such. Hopefully everything's going to be okay with that. I adjusted my microphone so now it's a little bit more sensitive. Um, I don't know. It's, I do that normally when I don't talk with other people. Also, um, I adjusted the music. I turned it down one. And then the everything else I turned up one. Yeah. So what we gotta do is retrieve data disk from the Confederate network and Rainer must survive. Also, I think I turned up the game volume for you guys. Rainer here. So this is a no build mission. Good. I cannot build anything yes. and whatever I have is well, whatever I have. Anytime we got Jimmy. He has 18 plus three for his God's rifle. He literally has plus three plus three. Is that six armor? What is that guy doing? Oh, yeah. Technically, you could do this whole entire thing with what? Soul, souling as uh, Jimmy? That should be good. But run away? Oh, yeah. But we're not going to run away like that. Sounds fun. We're going to investigate this area. Uh, do we really want to take these guys out? Yeah. Oh, yeah. These are researchers, apparently. No. Civilians? This is Jimmy. 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 This should be good. What are you doing, my guy? So what we gotta do is we gotta find a terminal, specific terminal. Firebats are a good touch to everything, but I don't know. The problem with the firebat is they have to go up to their target and then like a one second or something like that, half a second, and then they activate their attack. So like this guy, he just goes up to him and then there's like this half a second until they until he connects. It's kind of weird. Instead of like immediately connecting. Let's beat up this marine. I believe I know the way out of here. Well, we're just gonna explore a little bit. Why not? Oh yeah. We're here. Why not? Right on. Sounds fun. This should be good. Oh yeah. Good to go. Oh no, we need. Oh, that guy has one HP. Nice. Sounds fun. Right on. We might need Jimmy for the latter half of this mission. This should be good. The issue with going up and down stairs is it just takes forever. Oh, look at that. It's a Marine. Yeah, go get away from me. You got the cooties. I keep thinking this is Burrow. Burrow's an upgrade that the Zerg have that they can... Wow, we went in a circle. I'll just go right back up again. Uh, there was this section we haven't explored. But yeah, the Zerg has that burrow, and 
you can't really see it unless you have detection. But to, in that case, it looked like it was Burrow. Sounds fun. This should be good. Sounds fun. What is this? Teleportation field activated. Jimmy, get in there. This should be good. Hey, you're not allowed in here. Security cameras. Security cameras. So I'm pretty sure this is where we gotta go. We got a fire bat. There's a ghost. He does 10 damage? That's four shots to a, a marine and it's dead. My goodness. All right, let's go. Teleporters in this game is kind of weird, huh? This was made in 1995, like the base game is. And the the updated one, which is Brood War, which is the expansion to this, was in 1998. I kind of like that year, not going to lie. But... It's still under the the era of under 2000, oh, yeah. the 90s, and uh, it's still kind of weird to see Sounds teleporters fun. and stuff like oh, that. Yeah. How fluid that is Sounds in fun. 1995 type of a game. Right on. This I kind of like it. Oh yeah. Right on. This should be good. So we gotta go here. I believe we have to go here and here, both of them, and then go over here, or is it just? Go on to this one. We'll test it out. Is this door locked? No. Sometimes doors can be locked. Ah, oh, that's gonna be handy. The fence system got taken out. So the things that are on the wall, like this one, like this one over here, whichever it was, it'll be no longer activated. By the way, these are critters in the game. Uh, I'll show you guys what they actually look like. Look at that. Go ahead, Commander. <laughs> For some weird reason. Ooh, Zerglings. You rebel scum. This should be good. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. This should be good. How much do these Zerglings have? Five damage. Zero carapace. Right on. I don't believe this. Believe it. I saw Zerg with a Confederate heads myself, and that was over a year ago. It's clear the Confederates have known of these creatures for some time. For all we know, they could be breeding the things. Be that as it may, our priority here is accessing the Confederate network. We'll deal with the Zerg another day. I like how I couldn't move at all, my screen or anything like that. You can attack these creators. I won't do that today. Today. I might accidentally fire upon them one of these days. This should be good. Yes. I just realized everybody has 3-3. That makes a difference, actually. So if I remember correctly, there was supposed to be security right here and it was brutal to get through if you don't take him out like that guy don't mind him come on jimmy i need you with your dad bod your what were what were you what was people call them battle cruiser pants or something i mean they're not wrong also they're not right either i mean they're jimmy's pants Right on. Oh, yeah. Sounds weird. Sounds fun. Oh, yeah. Is there a teleporter? Oh! This is He's a detector. You got it. Oh! Go ahead, Commander. I lost... I lost something? I lost a Marine. Sounds fun. Was it the one? Ah, uh, it was. The Sounds 1 fun. HP Marine. Oh, yeah. Mainly, this mission is just an A-click, to be honest. It's just trying to find the way through. Unauthorized entry detected. Okay, we got is another... 10 damage for the cannons? Right on. This should be good. You got it. 
We need all the DPS. Also, those turrets are just pathetic. Fire now. Anytime you're ready. Fire now. Astro Raider here. Oh, yeah. Okay, ghosts are scary. This is Jimmy. This should yep, be good. here comes the ghost. And then all you really need to do is get Jimmy to the point. Is that a... It looks like an NES. <laughs> okay. Short mission. In the wake of the chaos resulting from the Zerg invasion, the Sons of Korhal escaped with the stolen data disks. There's Jimmy. Fleeing to the border colony of Antigua Prime, Arcturus Group, now plans its next crucial moves against the Confederacy. Thirteen hours after the evacuation of Marsara, Protoss warships took up orbit around the colony and unleashed a massive attack. <laughs> All life upon the surface was extinguished. I don't read fast, okay? I, I read at a reasonable pace. Hey, man. Headquarters has begun analysis of the disks. They expect to have them decoded shortly. I hope whatever's on those disks is worth it. Receiving incoming transmission from Arcturus Minsk. You and Captain Reyna have done well, Commander. I believe our efforts have weakened the Confederacy's grip on the fringe worlds. But our job out here isn't done yet. Lieutenant Kerrigan, my second in command, will elaborate. I'll get straight to the point. Our sources tell us that Antigua Prime is ready to begin open revolt against the Confederacy. Unfortunately, the Confederates seem to be aware of this as well. They've stationed a large detachment of Alpha Squadron troops there, under the command of General Duke. It will be your job, Commander, to free this colony and show our good intent to the Antiguan people. Lieutenant Kerrigan will help you deal with Duke's officers. The rest of the Confederates are yours to deal with. So we gotta bring Kerrigan to the Antiguan Command Center, defend the Antiguan rebels, and Raynor and Kerrigan must survive. I say that specifically because I tend to lose guys, so. It's like Pokemon up there. This should be good. So now Jimmy's in a, in his marshal. No, Jimmy's in his bike. He's a marshal, first of all. Second of all, not spider mines. This is Jimmy. Sounds now we gotta find Kerrigan, which is right here. I finished scouting out the area. You pig. What? I haven't even said anything to you yet. Yeah, but you were thinking it. Oh, yeah. You're a telepath. Look, let's just get on with this, okay? Right. So the special thing about Kerrigan is Kerrigan has energy, and this energy will, uh, what now? the energy will be a reproduce? No, uh, it will regen, that's the words for it. So if I hit cloak, she will slowly actually go down because she's cloaked. But if I decloak, her energy will go up. What now? She also has lockdown, which is very handy in certain situations like this one. So lockdown is a fair and balance um, the ability. How come I can't speak? I have them hotkeyed a little bit differently how they normally want you to have it. Because me personally, I can't hit the... What was e what was lockdown before? Was it L? 
Like, that just sounds weird. Not gonna lie. So can I outrange the missile turret? The answer is no. So... Come on. Oh, is that one? That one! You really want a revenge from that. What I'm gonna do is put down a spider mine. So spider mines in this game, it's kind of weird. So spider mines deal damage to everything on the ground besides hover. So for instance, Jimmy, it's kind of weird, but Jimmy is considered hover. Anything that is a... I was gonna let them come over here, but this is a bad start. Um, you know what? Cloak her, cloak her up and get in there. There's no detection. Yes, I was gonna lock down that Goliath. So there's another thing in StarCraft 1, like for instance, this bunker is getting attacked by this, you know this is on the high ground, that... That bunker's almost done. The main reason why is in StarCraft 1, they have it to where... I'm picking up a large confederate strike force advancing in our position. Well, they're not wasting any time. What now? It'd in StarCraft, there was a thing of vision for... Should I go just straight up Wraith? I should. Standing by. Vector locked in. It's W, okay where you can attack someone if you're being attacked from the top you can attack it back you get vision for just the one unit or structure it's kind of weird they give me two factories so where i gotta go is i gotta go down here this whole entire section is cut off from the water Roger. And I gotta go bottom left. Roger. Vector locked in. Commander, rock and roll. Give me some of this shoot. Standing by. Coordinates received. So what I'm gonna do is just build a bunch of raids. Attack formation. It's gonna be not preferred because what you wanna do as well, besides, I like to clear this area out up here. I don't think there's any reason for it, but, oh, oh. I gotta build a bunker up here. Yes, sir. So what ends up happening is they'd like to drop. And the further you are on this mission, the more drops they do and such. So there comes a drop. Up on the top up here. I forgot this isn't StarCraft 2. Where you can actually, like, do lots of cues and stuff like that. Wait a minute, I can make raids without the control tower? I mean, I'll take the control tower. Hold on, before we even get any further than this... Okay, it is as far as it's gonna go. Also, I put this further away from this geyser. I feel like it's just better for me to make a second base, put it next to the geyser. Go ahead. I'm waiting. Standing by. SCB, good to go, sir. 
We're gonna put Rainer in the back. We're gonna get enough SCVs to mine this so I can get enough for 400 to mine just gas. 8,000? There's also a second base over here as well I can always take. I'm gonna start. Start picking off all these guys down here. Pretty sure they rebuild them, anyways. So, the bright side about these raids is that I can always repair them. So, I'm gonna go back up here, get them repaired up, and then go again. I have enough for a command center. SCP good to go, sir. Right away, sir. Roger that. Can I read you? Standing by. Do I need two on this? Uh, it'll work. Can I get an armory? I cannot. So there's upgrades also for the air. That'll be fine. There's upgrades for the the air. And for the machinery, and we apparently don't have any unlockability for it, so. Rip. Go ahead, Rip. I read you. Roger that. Oh. I'm close to running out of gas. Order scout. Speaking of running out. Order scout. So there is a good news about the command center being built. So the command center also gives us some supply as well. It's not a total waste. Though, in the later game scenario, it is a waste. So, I'll be able to get 50 from this. When this command center gets done, how much do I get? I get 10. Do I want 3 on this? Or four. In StarCraft 2, three is the preferred, and it looks like three goes well with that, so we're good. And I can start making more raids. <laughs> that widow, uh, not widow, that's a, that mine did wonders. I'm stuck with widow mines in my head. Okay, let's go over here again. Okay, they remade him again. Run, 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 run. Well, I'm getting some kind of value off of this. And they do not like me using raids. So this gives me Wraith Energy and the ability to cloak. Is there any detection down there? There is none. I can do this. It would be worth it. And then I got my depot. I remember what we said last time. Band in the bunker. Do I need any more SCVs in this? Absolutely. And if we ever need to make another base, we can. I need to make a second. Do I? I have 8,000 gas. Yeah, let's make a second. Yes, sir. 
I wish I could get upgrades on the Wraith. The Wraith is so weird of a unit. Its attack on ground is, like, pathetic. But its air attack is so good. I got Cloak. Do I really need the reactor? I could get drop ships. That might be helpful in this. They also... They, as in... People say that the... The Wraith is just a joke. I guess to them they, that it is, but... There's, there's versatility in it. Specifically TVT. I don't think I need to make another control tower for this, so we're just gonna... Just start making raids. Once I get a full squadron, I will head out. Uh, can I make a... I cannot make a... a Comsat station. I'll show you guys when we get that. Actually, I'll make a academy for that. My backup plan? Marine, Marine, Marine. Marine is strong. I'm making another command center over here. Actually, you know what? Who needs dropships? Standing by. Reporting in. Reporting in. Go ahead, command. All I need is three more. Sector locked in. To be honest with you guys, it, it I mean the rate does pretty good damage on the ground. So now I can make a comsat station. I read you. And this is my contingency plan. Reporting for duty. Rate the waiting launch orders. I'm gonna move these guys down here. Standing by. Reporting in. Roger. Bring those guys down there. There's nothing else in that. Should I just continue making raids? That's a hundred gas, and I only have seven thousand. Technically, I can only make seventy more raids out of this. I might have to rethink my strategy here. I will get this. I don't think this will uh, finish once we start attacking because we're actually going to be attacking real soon. But uh, it's contingency. If my raids actually survive long enough, it'll be great. I'm gonna bring some SCVs over there. We got cloak. Just gonna stack them up. I mean, you could do this in a different way. There's people who say that you can do like do things a little bit different than that. Like you can put a say, for instance, like an SCV in the group, and it will it will group everything up. Don't attack those. So these are Goliaths. They deal. A, a pretty hefty amount of damage. That does 20 versus air and 11 versus ground, which is okay. I can't tell which one's the damaged one. Roger. So Comsat Station is 200. Crap. I should have just cloaked it. It does 50, 50 energy to do Scanner Sweep, which is a detector as well. I could do this anywhere. Your forces are under attack. So they have Vulture Mines of their own. The main reason why I went with Air. But also, I can't really get any further because of these missile turrets. That's where these guys come into play. 
I took more losses than I need to. I'll just make another and another of those. I'll get stem. I'll make two more of those. I could just go back and reheal up, which I'm probably gonna go do that right away. No. We're not gonna do that just yet. I need to clear these mines. Speaking of drop. No, don't attack the, the SCV. Oh, he was aiming for the SCV. Right away, sir. Transmit coordinates. So they're over here. Let's land and let's land. Go ahead, command. Research complete. Coordinates received. Yes, sir. Orders received. So in order to repair, I got to go through the painstaking process of clicking on each individual one because repair in StarCraft 1, well, it's not, um, it's the word I'm looking for. It's not automatic. Like you can't just auto auto repair and such. It's not in the game at all. Which kind of sucks. Looks like when I moved my rates as well, it didn't... It stopped the repair and such, which is kind of interesting. Let's start making marines. Standing back. Coordinates received. Vector locked in. Reporting for duty. Yes, sir. Okay, this guy up, and we're good to go on this section. We'll just put these guys back to work. Transmit coordinates. Coordinates received. So full HP. Those guys over there. We could get upgrades, but I don't see why. I want to get a full fleet of a full fleet, a full control group full of Marines. Coordinates received. I don't see any more widow mines, but give me something to shoot. Go just start the hornet's nest. You want a piece of me, boy? Go, go, go! Standing back. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Standing back, commander. Standing back. Oh. Standing back. No, I don't want to do it to that. Let me do it to two. Go ahead. Go to standing. Give me Take out this, and we're basically home free. My Marines just died. Is there anything else I need to worry about on this base? Why still attack the missile turret? I need to put this as three now. Commander, stand it back. Coordinates received. Attack for me. Coordinates received. Let's try getting these burning. So once they start burning, I don't think the the AI will repair them. So if I remember correctly, if I'm just like attacking this structure and I just want to attack it and there's like something else attacking it, if I hit S, 
it will stop attacking and it will attack whatever Elsa is trying to attack it. Oh, look at that. The SCV is actually repairing it. Now we just go with the slow process of finishing this base off. I got almost a full squadron of boys left. Do I just need to take out the command center maybe? Stim at it. I don't use stim that much because it's it's a big life giver. Oh no, life taker. I like how I got all these ComSat stations and I only need one. That just shows you how much you can, how much you need just from one ComSat station. I have 7,000 minerals and 2,000 gas I can't spend. That's a lot. took 23 minutes to do that one mission. I totally forget that Scourge is actually in this game, in the base game, the not expansion. It appears that the Confederates are in a state of panic about the Antiguan revolt. I'm picking up a high number of Confederate transmissions going back and forth between their outposts and their headquarters on Tarsonis. Most of the transmissions are heavily coded, but wait, here's something. There's a General Duke calling from Alpha Squadron flagship NORAD 2. We crash landed and are being hit hard by the Zerg. Request immediate backup from anyone receiving this signal. Repeat, this is a priority one distress call. Zerg? Here? Serves them right. About time they got a taste of what it's like to be in there mixing it up. Jim, I want you to move in and save that base. I'm positive I didn't hear that right. Arcturus, have you lost your mind? Listen, I know Duke's a cold-hearted bastard, but an entire colony shouldn't have to suffer for that. Besides, a Confederate general could prove to be a powerful ally. This is an opportunity we cannot miss. I don't like this at all. I'm not asking you to like it. I'm asking you to do it. Yes, sir. Great. Let's get this over with. We gotta protect Battlecruiser NORAD 2? And bring Rainer and two dropships to Norad 2. Rainer here. Oh, yeah. I read you. Roger that. Rainer here. Yeah. Reporting for duty. Order for duty. Oh, no. Not the, not the Marine. He'll be fine. Roger that. Anytime you're ready. Order for duty. I read you. Does the engineer bay need to be? Oh, he does. Um, yes, sir. Right hold on. Sir. I'm like, does it really need it? Starts burning immediately. Okay. Not enough minerals. Nothing in these bunkers. What kind of, what kind of show are we running here? Not enough minerals. Oh, it's not burning. We're fine. That Goliath almost died. Insufficient. But I can't repair it. Give me some of this shit. 
Because, well, the lights cost gas. Insufficient recipe gas. So the good thing about engineering bays, it can be lifted up and landed somewhere else. It's landed over here. Gives me more room over here. What do I want to go for? Conversion Zerg. What kind of units do I have unlocked? Go ahead, Commander. I mean, I got spider mines. This should be good. SCP, good to go, oh, sir. Yeah. I'll use this as scouting Sounds potential. Fun. Right on. This should be good. Report for duty. Scouting slash maybe blowing them up. Hold on. Before I continue, I have to keep doing this. We're going over here. That is just a better optimal place. Sometimes I don't understand this game and its logic. Anytime you're in it, man. Outstanding. Rock and roll. SCP, good to go, sir. Orders received. Anytime you're ready. Yes. I mean, I got a fire bat. I guess I'll put it in there. Report for duty. Do I have time to make another command center put it right next to the gas? Orders, Captain. Real question, how close can I get it? Like, maybe right here? SCP, good to go, sir. Um, I'm gonna put the barracks... No, I'm gonna put the barracks underneath this. Yes, sir? I'm working with small amount of space inside, and I don't want to, like, cram everything in here. Anytime you're I'm just gonna make some marines. SCP, good to go, sir. Yes, sir? I'm gonna make the refinery. We're going to long distance mine first. Because I need gas like yesterday. SCP, good to go, sir. Piece of me, boy. Roger that. Commander, rock and roll. I need the U 238. What is it? U. Whatever the shells is from the academy. Orders received. Which requires gas. I read you. Let's put four on it. SCP, good to go, sir. Orders, Captain. Right. I need five on it to be more. Kind of. Five would be the preferred for it. Orders, Captain. You want a piece of me, boy? Oh, I got a factory net. No, not a factory, but an armory. Oh no, my Goliath died. I read you. That's a bummer. Let's just start repairing. Oh. Well, that ability was called. What was that called? Ensnare. Makes my guys go slightly slower. Slightly is an understatement. Why did I say slightly? It's like abnormally slow. Some tells me they were trying to attack. Rainer here. Standing by. So there's this thing up here, which is gonna be fun. Uh, I'm gonna go with the factory, and we're gonna push out some Viking, not Viking. Starcraft 2, Garrett. Some, and that's not even in the factory. Some vultures. Why did I say factory? Why did I say Viking? It sounds so weird. Specifically talking StarCraft 1. Where does this go? It goes like right here? So I'll just put that over there. We're gonna build one right there. It gives me, again, 10 extra supply, which is great. And gives me another place to build SCVs and get another commsat station and mine gas more effective. Do I really need infantry weapons? I do not have a lot of minerals in this. 
So I'm gonna go two. <laughs> two fac. Two factory. Go ahead, Commander. Hey, get back here. Almost done. So vultures cost only 75 plus with two of my... Is that a marine? Um, <laughs> just now realized. All right. With two supply. I actually should be getting the machine shop first. Oh, I feel like I'm going to box in my guys like this. Let me move my guy. My... One barracks down. So now I don't need a third person on gas. A fourth person on gas. All I need is three. And it looks like they also do stuff with. Why that? Just why? Yes, sir. Affirmative. So we're going to get an armor. I'm going to put it right there. Not enough minerals. Um. It's, it sucks when it, you literally have to research the spider mine upgrade. Kind of sucks. Makes sense, but kind of sucks. All right. I want free vulture mines. What do you want? Hmm. I see an issue that is going to happen. Anytime you're ready, yeah? I'll reach you, sir. Order, Captain. Job's finished. So now we can get vehicle plating, ship plating, vehicle weapons, and ship weapons. So we're going to start with vehicle weapons. Research complete. We're going to get vulture speed up. It looks like everything... Are you having a hard time trying to get in there, SCV? Okay, that's a yes. This is Jimmy. Jimmy's going with the group. Go ahead, Commander. To be quite honest with you guys, I think Goliath would be better in every single situation. Like, every single situation. But we're just gonna stick with this. Anytime you're ready. Maybe it's why I got these guys was for defense, just in case. Job right on. So I put down a couple more mines. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh, okay, that's a thing. Anytime you're ready. Okay, so these things are sunken colonies. This is a spore co colony. Also, my vultures are almost dead now. This should be good. Yes, sir. Are you. Upgrade complete. Roger that. Orders received. Units waypoint list is full. I've never seen that before. I read you. Uh, do I want? No, I need a starport, right? Yeah, I need a. I need two drop ships. What they don't tell you. Yes, sir. So after this one gets repaired, put these all back onto that. Anytime you're ready. This should be good. And we're just gonna. Attack. As long as Jimmy's alive, it doesn't matter. This should be good. This is Jimmy. I'll reach you, sir. Wow. That co that colony has tremendous Okay, we're going just Goliath. I wanted to make that work, but it wasn't gonna work, sadly. Roger that. So if I remember correctly, right, there is also a base up here. Oh, yeah. 
do forces along here. But there's two hydras as well. Okay, I'm going to get vehicle plating. Go ahead, Going online. We're going to grab the boys here and we're gonna get Jimmy. And these guys are tasked to take out the hydras. Yes, sir. Roger that. Goliath on the Yes, sir. Do I need to build another command center? Is that really necessary? Affirmative. Just build another barracks just in case. Go ahead, Go ahead Commander. Right on. Sounds fun. Oh, yeah. ah! oh, it's the it's it's not the creep clearing squad. It's the Anytime you're ready. Right on. This should be it's good. the spider mine. Oh gosh. This is why Jimmy's a vulture. Right on. Okay, that's all gonna be taken care of. There's no upgrades for the the Lyoth, which suck. Rainer here. Orders, Captain. Report for duty. I'm gonna have to go with the old old school tech technique of just marine, marine, marine. I mean, it's not really old, but it's. It's the thing that works the most. Go ahead, Commander. Channel open. This is Go Jimmy. ahead, Tarkov. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Anytime you're ready. Sounds fun. I should actually put that to two and this to one. Because I normally tap one a lot. Go ahead, Tarkov. Confirm. Alright. So the thing about with Zerg. Instead of them going down in health, like burning, like how the Terrans are, they actually reproduce, or... No, not reproduce, they regenerate. <laughs> I don't want to say reproduce. I'm gonna stutter step closer, so everybody shoots. The main reason why I got these guys instead... Right away, sir. The reason why I got these guys instead is they do tremendous damage. They do 13 compared to the vultures, which wasn't that great. And can attack air with 24. Go ahead and can shoot really far. Take out their workers. We're just gonna put all Q on that. Why not? Don't go after the Overlord. So you want to have like different compositions and such. In this case, I'm gonna go literal marine and Goliath. I don't know if it's a smart strategy. I'm just winging at the moment. I gotta remember what I have in each control group. One is Goliath, two is Marine. Commander, go, go, go. Give me something to shoot. You want a piece of me, boy? Uh, this is actually where I wanted my 1 1, but. Jacked up and good to go. It's just gas in the middle of nowhere. I need to get dropships. Two dropships with Jimmy. Jacked up and good to go. Not enough 
Not enough minerals. Oh, I didn't grab the U-238, whatever that upgrade is called. We're going to clump them up up here. Oh, come on, Goliath. Stop clogging everything. I need my other dropship. Systems functional. Stand in back. Let's move. There's the other dropship. Go ahead, Commander. Go ahead. Let's put Jimmy in one. Input coordinates. In the five. If this dropship, the one that Jimmy's in, dies, we lose the whole mission. Go ahead, HQ. It's kind of sad. Go ahead, HQ. Strap yourself in, boys. I got you that. And then we drop. Oh. Oh, no, 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 Jimmy. No, no, no. I'll open the gates for you. Go ahead, Jack. Nope. You. Uh, thank goodness that Jimmy wasn't in the dropship. Look at all this anti-air in the back, by the way. Something tells me they didn't want me to use any air for this mission. Go ahead, Tackle. Got dropship number two. Go ahead, Confirm. Go ahead, HQ. In the five, 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 five. Hang on. Go around the spore. Destination. In transit, HQ. You're about the last folks I expected to show up. What's your angle here, Minsk? Our angle? I'll give you an angle, you slimy confederate piece of sh Jim, enough. I'll handle this. The confederacy has fallen apart, Duke. Its colonies are an open revolt. The Zerg are rampaging unchecked. What would have happened here today if we hadn't shown up? Your point? I'm giving you a choice. You can return to the Confederacy and lose, or you can join us and help save our entire race from being overrun by the Zerg. I don't think it's a difficult decision. Join forces with you? I'm a general, for God's sake. A general without an army. I'm offering you a position in my cabinet, not just some backwater post. Don't test my patience, Edmund. We got a deal. You've made the right choice, General Duke. I can't believe you're really gonna trust this snake. Don't worry, Jim. He's our snake now. We gotta trust snakes, apparently. Don't trust snakes, guys. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I'm in the Sons of Core Hall. Oh no! <laughs> Oh, no, no. It's for next time, guys. Uh, that's going to do it for today, guys and gals. Thank you all for watching this live stream. Back, not live stream. This video of StarCraft Remastered. If you like what you see and you want to see more of it, consider hitting the like button. Consider subscribing and the bell icon. Because we're going to be publishing out even more of these in the future. And uh, I want to go through all of StarCraft 1, Brood War, and StarCraft 2. All through the whole campaigns. And uh, it's going to take me some time but we're gonna we're gonna get there and uh these might be spread out a little bit because i'm uh, i'm not recording these like every day 
I'm recording these like every so often, so you might be seeing like every few days, like every two days or something like that. So yeah, the bell icon is gonna be useful in that way then. And uh, yeah, that's gonna do it for today. Thank you all for watching this video, and I'll see you next time on StarCraft. Remastered and uh, cartooned. And God bless you all. <laughs>